Hey guys, Link264 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario World. The Sunken Ghost Ship. The first and only ghost ship where you can get Yoshi. And the first and only one that's underwater. Can be a tad difficult, but we shouldn't have too much problem. Or too many problems, I should say. And look at uh, Yoshi. He's sort of fades in and out. Ooh, booze! Haha! -ha. Oh, booze! Yeah, well, uh, you can't eat the booze. We'll just walk along the bottom. Oh, I didn't think that would hit me. Oh, God! Uh, yeah, you just basically got to navigate through the booze. If that wasn't already obvious. I want Yoshi, I want Yoshi. Move, boo! Oh, fuck it. Definitely want Yoshi now. I'm making this way harder than it should be. And uh, now, this should be the last batch of boos. Yep. Well, apart from this boo, and that boo, and the ring of boos. Probably could swim through them, but, well... Just... Fair enough. Whatever. Get down! Get down! Get down again! Star! Chance for one-ups, which we could do with a few. Uh, I'm more uh, thinking about getting the other star, because there is another star that you can... Ah, oh, I missed it. Crap. See if we can make it in the hole then. Nope. Oh god, I'm gonna die, I can tell. Now we collect the question globe thing. Question circle. The only appearance of it. But whoa, whoa, whoa! Holy hell! And welcome to the Valley of Bowser. Not uh, too much of a big surprise as we've seen it twice already. But, hey ho. Well, yeah, Bowser one. Yeah, as I was saying, the uh, thing that we collected at the end of that was uh, what Boom Boom drops. Basically, the same sort of thing as what Boom Boom drops in Super Mario Brothers three. But yeah, the only appearance of it in this game. Uh, I could do with a power up. Oh god! Come on, Big Mall. There you go. Oh. Look at the drop! And you're not going to happen. Any chance you can uh, provide me with a power up? Yeah, that's. Oh god, why did I do that? That's power up enough, I think. Oh yeah, he disappeared, that's fine. Um, ah! There you are. Actually, come in handy. Oh, that was my own stupid fault. Three up moon. I could really do with a power up. I don't know which way to go. Nah. Ah, I suppose we best go on the top, aren't we? Come on. Oh, fuck oh, fucking. Come on. Oh god, there's not there. Ah, uh, he's gone, that's fine. Uh, that'll do me. <laughs> I'm gonna take one just for my own protection. Because I've gone the wrong way again. 
Fair enough. Right, we need to get down there. I'm gonna wait until they disappear. Power up, maybe? Oh god, no, but we've got a vine. Oh, come on! Oh, we're doing so well. Well, not too well, but we're doing okay. Um, can I go in here? Mm, probably not. I like the way the uh, midway point were up there and I got put down here. <laughs> Can't jump over you. Oh god no, invisible blocks. Don't you just love them. There we go. And... Um, yep, yep. I'm not bothered about that. There you go. And that was, that was what I should have done last time. But, ah well. 21. Take a drink. One million three hundred sixty-one thousand is our score. Well, this has a red button, so there are two exits. Um, this can be quite a long level, and I wish I had a power up because there are bats. Uh... Oh, wrong way to jump. Yes, there are bats. Uh, well, swoopers, I should say. There are swoopers that you cannot see that come from the top of the screen like that. I would like your shell, my dear friend. Oh come on, I was just about to say that worked out good. Turned out nice again. Hey hey! Don't ask. Do not ask. Mario's a serial killer. <laughs> See, that's why I don't like uh, making those jumps. Um, my sound... Oh no, it hasn't. I was going to say my sound's gone off, but it hasn't. Now then. Get rid of that fucking thing. Secret cape up here. Yay. And Yoshi wings. Cannot do anything about them at the moment, but you know. Now this room is where it starts to take a long time. Also can be a bit uh, a bit tricky if you've never done it before or whatever, but you shouldn't have you shouldn't have too much trouble with it. Basically the floor moves up and down and you've got to stop yourself getting squashed so obviously you don't run there because you'd have nowhere to run to. You run this time so that you can go in that little gap at the bottom. But yeah. Uh, I think this is the last level I'm, I'm going to do and then I'm going to take a break because I made some food and I just, I just remembered about it. Oh! I'm sorry about that. <laughs> sorry if I deafened you. Uh, yeah. I made some food and I've just remembered about it. The reason I've just remembered about it is yeah, I can hear the oven beeping. So I'm going to finish this level and then... You won't even know I've gone, to be honest with you. But, yeah. We might as well collect these coins here. No else to do. Yeah, that one's uh, probably one of the more tough runs you've got to make. I think we can go all the way here. Uh, oh no, I wasn't going to go all the way there. Just in case. Oh god! I wasn't expecting that. I'm supposed to be a, well I'm not supposed to be a pro, but I'm supposed to be good at this game man, come on. Oh my god. I'm just making it through with the skin of my teeth here, aren't I? 
but that is the end of it. So, all good. Now we have to run. I'm going to go up here first. Because this is the secret exit. And I shall meet you uh, where we just came out of that pipe. So, yes. Hey guys, right. Let's get on with the normal exit then. Which is, obviously, you just go to the end of the level, as usual. Damn it, the same exact thing to happen, happen to Revigilance. Exact the same place. Oh well. Oh well. That was the normal exit to Valley of Azure 2, so the Valley Ghost House, somewhere small, and yes. Until the last ghost house in the game. I do believe. So let's see what we've got. Oh god, green bubbles. Uh, uh, door. Now this uh, actually has a um, secret exit. There it is. Uh, yeah, this has a secret exit, and to get to it, you need to go all the way to the end of this and go in door 5. Then you need to get a P, this, grab this P switch, and um, hit the P switch, and make yourself a coin snake up here. Oh god. No, I've lost it. Oh no, I didn't! Wow! Yes! First try! Even though we did have a little bit of failage. First try! Get in there, you beauty! Right, let's do the normal exit for the Valley Ghost Dogs. Didn't really have a lot of chance to explain that. Uh, yeah, you've got to go right to the fifth door uh, out of five, obviously. I think it. Um, I'm not sure what the other doors lead to. I know, dude, I know obviously they'll uh, lead to the normal exit, but I'm not sure which ones lead to the normal exit. Dude, don't go that way. Yeah, I don't know which ones lead to the normal exit, so... We'll clear as much of this as we can. Actually, we got right all the way to the end, so okay. Well, we'll take door number... Three. No idea why. Oh, well, there you go. 22. So, I would suggest to go through door number three for the normal exit, and door number five is obviously the only way you can get to that P-switch to get to the secret exit. Valley of Bowser 3, then! Up, 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 up. And this is, uh, these are timed platforms. So, timed platforms and a pit are the best combination. As things like that happen. Great stuff. <laughs> Either way, I killed one of them, I'm not bothered. Yeah, not the hardest level, even though I have just died. Clearly it's a lot easier with a cape, but I have no cape. There's a bonus game there if you want it, I don't. I do however want that. Ah. I thought I was trying to be smart there. Kip. Well, it's still a power up, and it'll do. Wow, playing ping pong here. 
Go down. Yeah. Uh, something I could talk about, I suppose, because uh, this is supposed to be a let's play where I talk. Uh, I went to a work, a back to work thing today. Uh, which was a complete pile of shit, I must say. Basically, I've uh, had to go with uh, a recruitment company. Oh, not a recruitment company, but like a. Um, yeah, sort of like a recruitment company thing that helps you get back into work after you've been out for a while. Uh, I went for my initial interview a few weeks ago, you know, gave me, uh, asking me what I've done in the past and what I'd like to do now and things like that, you know, looking over my CV and things. Um, and then I went in today for a welcome meeting with a bunch of with a bunch of other people uh, that have obviously had to go on to this um, go with this place now this place is supposed to be like a one on one oh god come on stop talking it's supposed to be like a one on one thing you know you speak to an advisor and then you get a job well you don't get a job straight away but you look for a job uh, and they tell you how you can uh, help yourself and things Today, when we went in... Oh, come on, dude! I can't even make the first fucking jump! I'm just going to leap a faith across it. Let's see what happens there. Um, I knew that was going to happen! I just knew it! I'm going to go back and get a, a mushroom while I'm still talking. Um, yeah. Like a... Um, You have to do... Oh, come on, that didn't even register. That's not right good, is it? Uh, things you have to do today, fill out forms. And listen to procedures and things. You know, like fire exits are here and all that stuff. All I did for 45 minutes was sit there and do nothing. Why did I do this? Because I'd already filled out the forms and listened to someone talk at me for however long it was. So it was a complete waste of time. DUDE! Why can't I not even make it past the first jump? This is redonkulous. I don't care. I honestly do not give a tiny rat's ass. So was that so difficult? Now the secret exit for this level, you need Yoshi. Thankfully, they give you him here, but you need to keep him till the end of the level. Which can be a bit difficult. But, oh god, we shall see. That'll, that'll do me, I don't even care about the one up. I would really prefer to have a cape. There we go. I know, we could fly, but there ain't really anywhere that we can fly to. What am I doing? Oh no, no, Yoshi, Yoshi! Bitch. Yeah, we need a Yoshi to lick that key and then walk into the keyhole. That didn't happen, but we shall do it this time. Wow, what? So if we go back in, probably about four. Hopefully we won't have to do as much fucking trouble as I did. Can I? Uh, yeah, I can. There we go, you see. 
No one messes with me. Do you know who I am? I'm Linker264, Mother Hubbard. Mother Hubbard, where the friggin' hell did that come from? Yes. Egg. Yoshi. Keep him. I don't know what's down there, I'm not gonna even go and see. Probably a pit of water or something, but I'm, like I said, I'm not even gonna bother going to see. Oh, come on! Oh, come on! No! Oh. Well, we can leave then, can't we? Yeah, see, that's, uh, I suppose, the good thing about having uh, done that level first. Done the level first so that I can just go back and get Yoshi if I need to. Because it's not too difficult. You know, he's here. Well, he's not here, but he's up. Uh, he's up here. Ah, there we go. No! Fucking hell. Nearly left him behind then. See, that's what I was trying to do in the first place. I would like that. No, oh, you can't eat those, Yoshi. Oh, come on! <laughs> Fair enough. Well, what I'm going to do, I will go into a level with Yoshi. Ah, a level that I can get Yoshi in. Hmm. I'll be back in a minute, guys. Hey, guys. Got Yoshi again, so... I have just been a Yoshi at Chocolate Island 2 to get him. Oh, don't even start, Yoshi. You get a smack bum. No. <sighs> right, don't get hit. Ha ha! And that is the secret goal to um, Valley of Bowser 4, which leads to a star road and to the front door. Yeah. Well, we've got one more thing that we need to do, and that's the Valley Fortress. Obviously, we've still got to do the seventh castle, but yes, we have this fortress to do first. The Valley Fortress. I can't remember. Um, which one's this? No, still can't remember properly. It doesn't look too difficult. Oh god! Spoke a bit too soon there, maybe. Ah. Yeah, I think these ones move a bit faster now. Oh god! Ah, oh, you can't jump through them. Oh god, this is going to make it difficult now. I wasn't expecting it to come down as fast. Uh... Oh, yeah. Of all them spikes, the portable kills me. Okay, I'm back, guys. Let's see if I can uh, get through this. Oh, come on! It died! Ah! How am I supposed to get through that, really? Oh, it crushed me! Ah. Well, it doesn't look too difficult. Difficult, difficult, difficult. Okay, guys, I'm back. Oh my god, I actually made it! You've just seen all the fails there. 
what, I've died about 18 times, probably more. So yeah, not the best. <laughs> oh, we nearly just failed there. Oh well, that's that done. Right. Just the last castle to complete. And that goes to the back door. Oh. Well, Larry's castle. I'm going to take a little break. So, yes. Castle number seven, Larry's castle. Oh, the final castle, guys, apart from Bowser's castle, of course. And it is hard. I ain't gonna lie. But I don't think we'll fail as much as we did in the Valley Fortress, to be quite honest with you. That was just ridiculous. That was really, really bad. Uh, I am going to show you all those deaths. Well, you've already seen them. Oh, God. Yeah, you've already seen them, but... Yeah, I'm going to edit all those together and... Uh, you're going to laugh. Or cry. Either one would be appropriate. Ah... <sighs> Now, there's actually a sort of mini-secret in this. Um, uh, yeah, there's sort of... Oh, God. Sort of a mini-secret in this, as there is a midway point um, that is quite hidden. And... I am going to go ahead and get it because I don't fancy doing all this again if I do fail. So there's the door that you have to go through. And yes. But down here is a secret midway goal. So yeah. At least I don't have to do that bit again if I fail. More pencils, skeletons, uh, skeletons? Um, dry bones and of course everyone's favourite Magic Cooper Magic Cooper um, I always saw that person the Magic Cooper I always saw it as um, oh what you call her I can't remember what you call her now Dude! I can't even get my friggin... Oh, come on! Come on! That doesn't help me. That doesn't help me either. No! There you go. Even though now I'm small and have barely no time left. Come on, come on. No, 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 no. Okay, I'm back here, guys. And let's take on Larry Cooper. Exactly the same as the first boss fight, except you have um, portables, so not too difficult. And that is the end of World 7, guys. Ooh. Just, just, just get rid of it, Mario. Mario has defeated Larry Cooper in castle number 7. All that is left is Bowser's castle where Princess Toadstool is being held. Can Mario rescue her and restore peace to Dinosaur Land? 
Well, I guess we'll have to find out next time, guys. Because that is the end of part 7. Continue and save. Next time, we're going to start Star World, and I'm saving Bowser's Castle for the end of the LP. So I'll see you next time, guys, on Star World. So, take care.